Hello, gentlemen. Patrick Ryan here, founder of Wingman for You. We help men find the woman of their dreams by teaching them how to approach women with confidence. Now, guys, this video is specifically about online dating. We have a ton of men that just want to do online dating. They feel a little anxious when they approach women organically, so they would rather do it kind of behind the scenes. So guys, here's the challenge, is that us men, we, we are critically making four mistakes that are preventing, in fact, even blocking women from responding to us when we reach out to them. Raise your hand if you're one of the guys that has a hard time getting women to respond to you. Yeah, I, I was in that same boat many years ago. When I first started online dating, I had nobody to help me. I just filled things out and I guess learned as I went. So guys, here's the four mistakes. Number one, photos, okay? One of the biggest mistakes, one of the biggest turnoffs that women see in men's profiles is their photo. You know, showing some muscles, big bare chested. No, they don't want to see you sitting there chugging beers at the park. Okay. What they want to do is they want to see somebody who looks like a nice guy, your average Joe. If you're really good looking or perhaps you're not that attractive, it doesn't make any difference. Do not put pictures of you and your 35 dogs. Took, take pictures of things that maybe you do that are active. For me, it's cycling and golfing. And get a couple of pictures of you having fun with friends. Don't take 37 photos, each of them mediocre. Take four or five photos. That's all you need, four or five photos. And get rid of the bare-chested, muscle-head type of looks. Some women like that, but most get turned off by it. Number two is the content in which you're writing. Now, guys, of course, you want to be grammatically correct, and that's easy to do with things like chat GPT nowadays, right? There's a ton of AI out there that will rewrite your whole profile for you. I suggest you using it. However, here's a few things that you want to put in your content. One, you want to put in there a little bit about your daily life. Like, what does life look like for you? Work, play, volunteer, athletics, sports, painting, drawing, reading, whatever that may be. I really love to read. I love these types of novels. However, I'm okay if my partner doesn't read. That's number three, is what is life like being with you? I'm looking for a partner who's looking for this. I'm looking for somebody who loves dogs. I'm looking for somebody who loves golf. I'm looking for somebody who loves to paint. I'm looking for somebody that can support my, my pots, my pottery business. I'm looking for somebody who can mow the lawns. I'm looking for somebody, whatever it may be, guys. All right, women will say that in their profiles. We men need to do the same thing. That means we need to think a little bit about what we really want in life. What do we want out of partner? Pretty simple. Some people want professionals. Some people, as a doctor, they may want another doctor, a biochemist, a scientist as their mate. And which brings me to the fourth thing, guys, is we also want to put in the content what we're looking for. Are we looking for friends with benefits? Are we looking for a long-term relationship? Are we out hunting and just dating and just to see what happens, see what materializes? Put those into your profile, guys. Now, I'm going to give you one tip here. And this is about when you message women. Okay, this is about online dating. Those four things, again, the four keys is having the right photos, having the right content. That content describes what your life is like and what your life is going to be like when you have a partner in it. And then also, what do you want? What do you want out of a relationship? What are you looking for? Those four things are key. Now here's one secret ingredient to get women to respond to you. Super, super simple. You're gonna now start scrolling through. You're gonna start looking. You're gonna say, oh, I really like her. Oh, we have some things in common. This is great. Don't tell her how beautiful she is. Ask her specific questions about what is in her profile. Oh, I see you're out walking a dog. How many dogs do you have? How old is your dog? Do you love dogs like I do? Whatever that may be, talk about something a little bit more in common. 
for me, my wife, I approached her. I said, you look like you're happy. That's all I said. You look like you're happy. I'd love to get to know more about you. Please respond if you're interested. She responded within 12 hours. Guys, it's not that hard. Make it short. Make it simple. You look happy. Hey, I noticed that you enjoy dogs. I have a dog myself. I noticed that you enjoy pottery. I love pottery. I love the, 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 the wheel and getting my hands in there and all muddy. Whatever it may be. Talk about them. Give a little bit of something about yourself. I'd like to get to know more about you. And let them make the choice. Guys, you'll get a lot more responses with a quality profile. It doesn't have to be super professional or anything, just a quality profile that has the right pictures, the right content that tells them what your life is like and what you want in a woman. And then when you reach out, guys, don't tell her she's beautiful. You might say, I really like your smile. That's okay. I said, you look like you're a happy person. Yes, I am. Terrific. Let me know if you'd like to. I'd like to get to know more about you. Let me know if you're interested. Something simple. Okay, guys, don't tell them your whole life story. You've got to make it a mystery. Thanks for tuning in, guys. I hope to see you on the next video. And by the way, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. I have some fantastic videos out there that's going to help you get closer to the woman of your dreams. Thanks for tuning in. I'll see you next time.